it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, as you guys can see by the title down there, we're gonna go from looking like this to this. So as you guys can see, I transformed myself. I just have been in a really bad funk uh, during this like self-quarantine and I wanted to um, put myself together, do my hair. I haven't done my hair in so long and I actually really like how it came out. I only had one bobby pin, so that's why only one strand of hair is in the back. My highlight is popping like it was a good makeup day. Before I get started, please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there. And if you want to know how I got this look and how I transform myself, so then just keep on watching. Okay, so I prepped my eyelids with the uh, Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. I'm going to take a really fluffy brush. This is a uh, E35 Sigma brush, super fluffy brush. And I'm just going to take a really light um, shade. I'm going to take, this is a Makeup Geek... I know this is a Anastasia Beverly Hills burnt orange shade and just work this on my crease. I haven't actually played with makeup in so long. Like when we first um, started like the whole quarantine, I was like, oh my God, like I have all this time and I want to do this, I want to do that. And I'm pretty sure I watched Nicole Guerrero's video. I watched, who else did I watch? Oh my God, I forgot. But I was watching a couple of YouTube videos and like beauty videos. And they were just saying like, even though they work from home, like already, um, like with the whole quarantine thing and like self isolating, they were saying how they, they're like fighting it really hard to like be like motivated to like do stuff and girl same so i'm gonna take this is a makeup geek um uh, deja brew shade and i'm gonna go in with a this is a sigma e25 but yeah i've been watching um like youtube beauty gurus and they've been talking about how they they're like finding it hard to um just get a motivation to do stuff and I can totally relate um, I think we've been in self-isolation for so my last day at work let's see my last day at work was May May was March 13 so let's see that's one two three four five six so it's in six weeks since I haven't been to work and We've been working from home and then just self-isolating i try to go and see my mom like once a week she's at my sister's and we go see my in-laws but like i literally do not leave my house and during the week so depending on the day that i want i go and like buy groceries and that's it like that's the only thing i do i wear like my mask and like gloves and that's like the only reason I leave my house and it's been it's been hard to like find the motivation yes you do have all this time I'm gonna take this shade um, had me at yellow that right here outside of my crease and I'm finding it hard to have the motivation to even like play with makeup um, I have like I've been playing like Animal Crossing and I've been watching netflix i've been i started jane the virgin again it's been hard to find the motivation to like film and play with makeup although i love playing with makeup i love putting on makeup and like i woke up today since yesterday i was like thinking like oh like i want to like film and like upload like last week i uploaded one video and that did not do great uh because the week before that i didn't upload anything um, and with YouTube, it's like consistency, like you have to upload at least one video a week or else you lose your like momentum. But next week I am going to be uploading. I have, so I do have um, two, I believe it's two, um, like the cluttering videos. I have this and like my ColourPop like um, eyeshadow collection that I have to film and upload. For next week so those are gonna be I already have those two videos 
Um, but let me know what type of videos you guys want to watch. And I'll definitely film them for you. So I'm going to take my glitter glue by Too Faced. And I'm just going to put that all over my lid. Because I'm going to go in with a glitter right now. My allergies have also been killing me. Hor like, it's horrible. I now really like have allergies and it's just been like really bad I need wow I like dropped a lot of glitter on my phone nice. I need Okay, so I have like washi tape here, which is like um, like decorative tape, and I'm just gonna grab and like clean my under eye. Obviously, you don't want to use a tape that's too that can be like really like bugging on your like lid or like your under eye. So I'm just gonna. I feel like it looks a little bit more. Um, bronzy than what I have on my crease <sighs> it's so hot in here I'm gonna move on and um, I'm gonna move on to my face and I'm just gonna apply a little bit of moisturizer I also um, remove all the peach fuzz that was on my face oh my god <laughs> so much peach fuzz if you guys haven't seen um, that video, I'm gonna link it up here. And it's I'm just showing you how I remove the peach fuzz from my face. And like today, I needed to do that. Oh my god. So I'm actually gonna go to the grocery store today because it's currently 2.16. And although there's probably gonna be a line, I just I need to buy toilet paper. I need to buy um kitchen towel thingies paper and I need to just go buy groceries because we don't have food to eat today <laughs> and I need to cook I usually go early on the day to prevent the lines and just like not do a lot of line but um it's been not that not bad. I actually just go just I mean people just go to usually like one grocery store. I go to three. I buy um, different things at different stores. And um Yeah. Now that I'm like filming right now and like putting on makeup, I realize how much I've missed this. And I know that um right now a lot of people are like, oh my god, this is your time to shine. This is your time to do all the things that you usually say you don't have time. Um, I mean, that's okay too. Just if you want to like take advantage or whatever on this time. But it is also okay if you like not do it. I've been struggling with that idea. And um, just hearing it from people around me like, oh my god. Like now you have so much time. Sometimes like you don't feel like it and I get it like you have to push yourself like I get that aspect of it but sometimes you're a little depressed and you just don't want to do anything and that's okay but just remember that you also have to push yourself which now I'm like doing my makeup and stuff like this is like my thing like I love doing makeup I feel like you do have to push yourself also so you don't unfortunately like get into that rhythm of life of not doing anything because that can also deteriorate your mental health been there telling you just i feel like one day at a time take it one day at a time decide something that you want to do that day give it priority and so like i've been giving myself little tasks to do daily so that i feel somewhat accomplished as and it can be as easy as doing your bed and that personally has helped me and I would recommend it just give yourself one small task to do 
a day and I feel like that's gonna help you feel somewhat accomplished during the day I know that you guys are like so good but and believe me I know that it's way easier said than done for concealer I'm gonna apply a little bit of the Tarte Shape Tape the same that I used to prep my eyelids I feel like this before this whole like self-isolating and like quarantine like there was like new releases literally every week I barely have been like hearing from brands that they've like been releasing like new makeup I'm gonna set my face I actually used the Kylie Cosmetics um, powder to set my under eye now I'm taking my um, MAC Studio Fix powder which literally I have to order a new one because look at that I'm literally like off to like the rim um, I actually do need to order a couple of things that I'm like running super low on like my back studio fix to contour I'm gonna use my Hoola Benefit um, powder but yeah look at those oh my god it looks so pretty okay so for blush I'm gonna take um, this MAC peaches uh, blush literally looking at myself in the mirror with makeup I'm like wow where have you been like I haven't done my makeup in so long that I'm like a different person and like my self-esteem is going up <laughs> I'm gonna use my Mac uh, whisper of guilt mm highlight just okay for my lower lash line I'm just gonna bring the uh, Tiki Hut um, eyeshadow from Makeup Geek and I'm gonna grab that on a Morphe M514 and just work this on my lower lash line so I'm gonna take a cream shade eyeliner and apply it on my lower lash line I'm gonna apply a little bit of mascara and something is bothering me in my eye. I'm gonna apply a little bit of setting spray because I feel like my face is gonna melt off and my camera. Okay, I'm gonna grab my Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. Okay, right, wow, I look glowy, low key. Um. A little bit oily, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm gonna take my um, Tati TL1 lashes. While my lashes are drying, I'm gonna take this NYX lip liner in the shade Lip Crayon or Lip, yeah, lip liner in the shade Natural. And after that struggle with applying those lashes, uh, I'm gonna go in with my lipstick. This is Aquarius by ColourPop. It's such a good everyday natural look. I'm gonna go and do my hair and I'll be right back. So that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed and if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe in the little button down there. As always the products that I use in today's video are going to be linked down in the description box and until then I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!